Hey guys, it's Sandy from Bakker Farms, and I'm here to cut my latest soap, more in the Easter or spring scents coming out, and I just made this last night. I'm sorry if you hear that in the background. My uh, daughter is watching a Titanic documentary, don't ask. She's like her mother. Anyway, look at that. Can you see that? See how pretty that is? Ooh. Mm. Oh, this is I call it lemon love and it is um, lemongrass kiwi and it's really just lovely hold that in there she want wanna come out and I know I haven't been on in a while haven't cut much for you guys to see but I've been doing a lot of cupcakes so those are kind of hard to no. There we go. Move that out of the way. Okay. Got a little, um, so I tried to be very much in keeping with the scent. Not that it has to be, but I wanted it yellow. I have a thing for yellow. And so it just looks fresh in the springtime. There's my top. Nice and glittery. Can you catch that? I know some of the lights around here are a little crazy bright. But I think it is lovely. And I actually feel bear with me. I'm gonna go get my scale. And check this out here. Let me just put this on. And we'll do a tear. We want to weigh this loaf. It is just over three pounds. My level. Just over three pounds. So that's just perfect. Um, with that, I was able to still make two, three, five more soaps, smaller soaps and smaller molds. So we are going to cut this first my mold again. I'm like a little discombobulated since I haven't really been cutting lately. Okay, I'll put this where you guys can see it. Okay, now, my dear friend who made us, excuse me, no, it's the problem with being lefty, and I set this all up the wrong way. I can't get my sample piece on. It fights against gravity here. But my dear friend who has made me a cutter said he was going to attempt to make one that automatically cuts that quarter piece. That quarter piece of sample for me. All right, so let's get going and cracking on that. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, pretty. And it's been over 24 hours. It's a little wet. I don't know if you can make that out with the glare. Clean that up. Set that off to the side. So I have a few other projects coming up. We have another spa bar, another blue spa bar coming up. There's my swirl. Try to do a little swirl in there. Not anything too outlandish. Um, so I have another blue spa bar coming. And I also can't wait. We'll start lambing in, hopefully, in about five weeks, Lord willing. And at that time, we will have fresh sheep milk for the uh, soap. This is my last batch of sheep milk right here. So I'm dying for some of that. That came out pretty. Look at that. Oh yeah, that's nice. And it's gonna be a nice moisture rich bar. So So 
So yeah, that'll all take place on Baca Farms in about five weeks. We'll do that. We'll store up all of our sheep milk with all those amazing buttermilk fats that are just awesome for our skin, which are trapped in by all this amazing glycerin that this handmade soap makes, huh? And we'll be nice and purdy, smooth and moisturized for the summertime. Share those, show those bare legs. So these again, for those who are wanting some of this lemongrass action, they will not be ready for another four weeks, okay? So four weeks from now, you can call in and have me hold them for you and you can do a prepayment if you want, but otherwise they will not be ready for another four weeks. I will have more Easter bunny cupcakes soon. Um, I'll be able to ship them out to you, even if they won't, if they're not completely cured. Um, and that's just because people are really inquiring. I just got another order for 15, so I'll be making some of those. And so, if you're interested in that, just let me know. You just have to email me or Facebook me, and that way. You know, I don't guarantee a hold for you. I just can't do that final cut. Where's that Georgie? So you can't do it. Not a chance. And we have a wider at the bottom, skinny at the top. Well, we'll have George take care of that. He'll clean that up. So there we have it. Some really, really... Fresh smelling, because these are really, really pretty scented spring soaps that are really, oh, boy, do I really have to fix that one bar. That is pretty crazy. So how about that, huh? I love the way these turned out. So just be checking us out on Etsy for any upcoming new things, any cupcakes. I mean, I always put it up on Facebook as well, but so we have 10 here. And we'll also have this fragrance in, let me see if I can pop this without a problem. I'm going to try and pop one of these. We're going to have these in a We have these also in a Boots and Spurs bar. We'll have a couple of those. And then uh, we have a couple of guest, uh, guest room size ones with this fragrance as well. All right, guys. Well, that's what I wanted to show you. I wanted to let you know. Also, just be aware. Uh, we just got contacted. So hopefully we will be, you will find our sheep milk soap in many of the B&Bs in the Skinny Atlas Finger Lakes area of New York City. New York State, excuse me. All right, so wish us luck on that. And um, I will talk to you all soon. Okay, take care. Hope you enjoyed. Give me some feedback. Take care.